talk about my story. Okay, actually, I'm just really excited that I'm far, far away from my kids. <laughs> yeah, tonight I'm just gonna... What the hell? <laughs> oh my god, they're here. <laughs> Who the hell are my kids in here? How does it feel to be the greatest mother in the whole wide world? Where did the babies come from? Oh, God! I knew it was from God! No, look, okay, we'll talk about this never, okay, though? You're looking man beautiful! <laughs> okay, that's cute, that's cute. <laughs> I know, buddy. I 
have a family lawsuit in my future. <laughs> but of all the stories that I've written, there's one that I really want to share with you tonight. It happened just this past year, February 23rd. So picture this. It's our home. It's about 5 o'clock in the evening, and I'm trying desperately to get dinner going. My husband, smart guy that he is, is off on a business trip. <laughs> Over a honey bun. 
fun. And now Bella is bawling her head off, okay? So I look away to the kitchen, right, to find Chance banging his head on the floor. <laughs> He's banging his head. So I peel him up off the floor, right, and I hold him for just a moment because my dog starts to whine. And then a bark. And then a look that says, I'm going to piss on your son if you don't take me out. <laughs> but you see, I can't because the timer on the oven has just gone off. So, I put Chance down on the floor, and the moment I let go of him, he starts screaming. I mean, the moment his ass hits the floor, it's over. He's screaming his head off, right? So, I grab an oven mitt, take the food out of the oven, toss it on the counter, and at the counter, I think he'll lose it. Bella is crying. Mia is crying. Chance is crying. And then my dog is crying, okay? <laughs> Everybody is crying. Okay, Chance. Start me down a little upset here. <laughs> I'm not totally there, but I'm getting there. Okay. Mia. Honey. Take a deep breath, okay? It's just food. It'll be okay. Chance, buddy. All right, let's, uh, let's think of something happy, okay? How about Thomas? Like, ooh, ooh, come on. <laughs> okay. Bella, honey. Why are you even crying? <laughs> Do you even know? Because I don't. <laughs> I think this is exactly what we need right now, okay? Because seriously, kids, I am about to lose my mind. I'm frustrated. I'm tired. And I'm alone. I wish that I could just hop in my car and drive away. But I can't. I'm trapped in home. <laughs> so instead I walk to the living room and I drop to the floor. Face down to my own tears, I wonder why does this have to be so hard? <laughs> I'm a good mom, but this, this isn't fun. No, this sucks. <laughs> But before I could wallow anymore, I noticed something. They're silent. As if they could tell exactly how I was feeling. And my son, he gives me the sweetest look. A look that says that though he's only two, he gets it. And he rushes over to kiss me and I hang on so tight. I register his weight on my arm. I breathe in his familiar smell. And then I hear me a giggle. And the sound of feet scampering, and before I know it, I got three kids jumping all over me. Rolling around, laughing. And it occurs to me, this is what's really important. This is what really matters. You see, I learned something here. Life, it's difficult. But drama makes life memorable. <laughs> see, even the shitty, whiny parts of my day are just minutes away from a laugh, or a hug, or a tickle, reminding us all that we're unconditionally loved. See, I'm so scared that I'm going to forget these stories. That's why I started this vlog. So that years from now, my kids can see how it really was. I want them to know the truth about our life, the good and the bad. Not just simple smiles from a scrapbook, no. No, I want more. I want a memorable life for my family. <laughs>